So, um, Youth MMA is this uh, new category we've just introduced. It's been introduced around the world by IMF in over 180 countries. And uh, India is one of the first countries to actually have a Youth MMA Championship. And this is the first Youth MMA Championship ever in the history of India. Um, now, we've got a couple of different rules that have come in for the Youth MMA. Uh, three main uh, factors, in fact. One would be that there's no face punches allowed either on the ground or standing. Um, this is primarily to prevent concussions for these kids that are coming in and getting introduced to the sport of MMA. Uh, the other is there's no over-the-shoulder throws. That is, you cannot throw someone over your shoulder. This is to prevent high-velocity throws from heights. This again helps prevent injuries. Uh, the third rule would be that there are no standing guillotines. Okay. Uh, now, all of these rules and the differences brought in from regular amateur MMA is to make the already uh, very, very regulated sport even more regulated and safer for the younger generation that is getting introduced to the sport and who is going to go into amateur MMA and hopefully professional MMA later on. Um, this is the gist of it when it comes to youth MMA. Uh, the first ever championship, we've done all the veins, everything is ready. The new refs have been briefed, the judges have been briefed and uh, we'll be starting off in about an hour. Uh, it's going to be great. So, come in. We've got girls, we've got guys and uh, you're going to see a lot of tomorrow's talent uh, starting off uh, in this tournament itself. So, the tournament itself till now has been great. This is the first tournament in India where there's two cages happening simultaneously. Technically, it's a bit of a challenge but since uh, uh, Sharif, uh, Prasad, Nitin, um, Vikas, uh, Sheikh Khalid, all of these guys have re uh, refed at the World Championships where we had four cages at the same time. Uh, it is something that we are able to manage and do well. So, today is the final, so we are going to have all of the senior referees and senior judges up there. We have managed to run a lot of training sessions while this is on also. So, the officials that are going to be coming out of this are going to be coming out with a lot more experience and knowledge. Um, some killer talent has shown out uh, over the last two days and this this tournament today, the finals, this is going to shape the and select the team from India that's going to go for the World Championships that's happening in Kazakhstan in November, the IMF World Championship, which is the premier uh, international platform for amateur talent when the, uh, with the sport of MMA. So, this is what we're building to and today's finals are going to open a lot of eyes. Um, I've got a bunch of kids there also, so let's see how it goes. You guys can catch it live on a locker room.